Hey guys, so it is officially fall and I have received my fall box from FabFitFun, you guys. So if you're not a member of FabFitFun, there are two memberships that you can get into. I have been a member since June of 2018. FabFitFun, I would call basically a lifestyle box. You get makeup, hair care, uh, health uh, stuff like um, workout equipment, fashion, jewelry, you name it, they put it in here, okay? So it's an overall like wellness box, okay? So there are two memberships that you can join. You can join the seasonal membership, which is you would just pay as the season comes every three to four months or whatever, um, which is $49.99. You do get the option to customize. I think it's either about three or four customizations for your box for that uh, quarter. Um, it's $49.99, like I said. You do get all full-size items in this box, you guys. You get, um, like, uh, what is it, like quarterly sales you can get into and all that lovely stuff. So, with the annual membership, it's $179.99. With that membership, you get to customize all the items in your box now. That is something new that they started, I believe, the last quarter. Um, so yeah, you get uh, access to sales earlier, your box is shipped a little bit earlier, and you got you get to customize your box earlier as well, okay guys? But regardless, there's supposed to be $200 or more uh, value in these boxes, okay? So this ugh, is my box, and we're gonna jump into this fall box, you guys, because like I said, it's finally fall time. It's finally October. Um, I don't know how your guys' weather been holding up, but here in Michigan, we've been having like an Indian summer, baby. One day it was like 90 degrees. The next day it was 58 degrees because it rained. Then the next day it was like 80 degrees. And the next day it was like 70 degrees. And yesterday it was like cold. And today it's warm. <sighs> you know why they call it pure Michigan? Cause it's pure bullshit. But anyways, let's get into this video. <laughs> but you guys already know what to do. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Make sure that your notification bell is on and take a moment to go to Instagram and follow me at b.estelle underscore 216, guys. So like I said, guys, this box is my favorite box to get into. Um, I'm just trying to figure out where to open this at because I have so much stuff on top of my desk right now. So we're going to jump into this. Um, there's usually like a magazine that tells you all the products and the prices and details. Usually they have some type of theme for the month. Basically just kind of telling you like, it's usually a person, some type of celebrity, all that type of stuff. So we're just removing paper. You do get lots of coupons and stuff in your box. Uh, one that was for HelloFresh, um, like different wine companies. You want to sample wine. It's just one. So here's the magazine for this month. And it says, Feast on Fall Favorites. Okay. So it looks like they're like gearing up for like, I don't know. This is like a vegan Thanksgiving. Um, <laughs> oh no, there's some meat in there. Okay. So we'll bust open the first item right now. Okay, guys, so you may have remembered from the last quarterly box that I had in the summertime that the magazine did not have the list or description or prices of the items that you received in your box. That is new. It looks like they did the same thing this time, except there's not a QR code to get to my list. You just have to go to your account and kind of just go to um, my box and look at the items that you got in your box. And they'll give you the description and price and all that. So, the first item I got in my box is like a little bundle set. And this is called the La Babe Lash Zoe Ayla and Dr. Uh, Rogers Restore Bundle. And it retails for $59.99. So, 
we're gonna view the item. The first item that I have that I've already kind of popped open was the Dr. Um, Rogers Restore Lip Balm in here. So let's see if we can get, get a little um, info. So it says, keep chapped lips smooth and hydrated with this high quality lip balm, reformulated version of the healing balm from summer 2019, made with castor oil. So this is what it basically looks like, you guys. Nothing spectacular, it's just a lip balm. I'm actually gonna put this on my badge because I have like a little badge pocket for um, lip balms and my new one for my new job doesn't have one. So let's just see. It says it has castor oil in it. I'm gonna be honest with you. This is a hard bomb. Like, as you see, I'm working it back and forth. And I feel like I'm still not getting enough product on my lips. Can you get a lip burn from doing something like this? Jeez. Like, come on. This is a hard bomb. I feel like I'm just not getting enough on my lips. I'm just going to be honest with you. This is not a good look, guys. I'm not sure how much this is going to keep my lips moisturized. I'm just being honest. I feel like my lips are dry already. You can see a little bit of shine, but there's not much. And y'all know these lips get dry, quick as heck. All right, so the second item in that bundle was the Babe Lash Pro Lash Lifter. Jeez, that's a lot. So that's this baby right here. And it says, give your lashes a uh, flirty boost with this uh, agronomically designed lash curler. Featured in rose gold finish, designed to comfortably curl and lift lashes. I mean, it's an eye lash curler. What else could you want? I'm honestly probably going to give this to one of you guys because I literally have like three already. I don't need a new one. So I'm going to show you what she looks like and put her back into the packaging. It looks like she came with extra... Um, curling pad right there. I'm gonna leave that in the bag. Dry clay. I don't know what that's, what that's supposed to be. It says dry clay or something in there. But it's a rose gold eyelash curler, you guys. Pretty typical. Okay. Pretty cute though. I mean, it's rose gold. It's cute. Um, so I'm gonna give that away to one of you guys. We still have our giveaway going on. We've only got a few days left. So definitely take advantage of that. So the last item in that bundle is the Zoe Ayla. These are eco-friendly comb sets. And it says two combs. Uh, let's see what the description says. It says this set includes a large, a large tooth comb and a small tooth comb with soft round teeth, which makes it easy to detangle hair and prevents breakage. Okay, let's see. Can we, there we go. Break in here. Okay, I do like combs like this. And this is, yeah, oh yeah. I need one of these. I just braided my hair and it's already coming down on one side. Um, but yeah, I do like combs like this. Because this, especially with how my hair is right now. You see this? Oh. Yep. Oh my goodness. This is every black girl's dream right here. <laughs> All right, so let's get into the next item. The next item in the box is from Uncommon James. And it is their hammered copper canister set. And it says the medium and large canisters include wooden lids um, to add a rustic touch to any space. Okay, so let's see. I don't mind adding anything to my kitchen. 
I love canisters. So let's see what these ones look like. Oh, these are really nice. Okay, let's, oh. can we get it open? Yes, there we go. All right, so it is like a hard, it's a real hard, like a real wood. Like it ain't fake wood, this is real wood. And these canisters are beautiful. So you could put anything in there like beans, rice, grits. <laughs> I love me some grits, y'all. I love me some grits. Let me get this paper and stuff out of our way. So these are canisters, a small one and a big one. These are nice. These are nice. Just has the silicone in there. These are nice. And the price of this was $49. These are some expensive pieces. Look how pretty that is. Not really the aesthetic of my kitchen, but we can always change things up. Let's look at the next item. The next item I received is from Coach, not Catch, Coach. This is their Coach Open Circle um, necklace and T rose stud set. And it says this delicate necklace and earring set in rose gold plated brass is a must have for a jewelry lover. And it says the necklace set in rose gold brass embellished with a silk uh, colored stone, coach engraved signature logo on outer edge with a lobster clasp. And then it says the T rose stud, um, they're basically just earrings an earring set in rose gold plated brass as well. And I like that it looks like it came with a little sleeve. So it came in a little coach sleeve, a little canvas. I think that's cute. And then let's see. Okay, that is cute. Okay, that is cute. Look at that you guys. So a matching little set. Oh, I actually do have a couple of um, coach accessories. So this is nice. Okay, this is really nice. I like these earrings. This is nice. And this was $125 freaking dollars, you guys. $125. I'll be with you. I wouldn't be paying $125 for that. Consider I only paid $49 for the box. That's a deal. Let's look at what else I got. The next item I got, this is the True Meringan Shea and Meringan Balm. It's a nourishing balm for hands and body. And it says, if you're dealing with dry chapped skin, use this balm to lock in moisture and provide long lasting protection. Features a blend of shea butter and moringa seed oil. Can be used daily on hands, cuticles, and other dry areas. Um, ideal temperature for a soft, creamy application. It says 65 to 85 degrees Fahrenheit, which is fine. Oh, it's thick. I can feel it. it's very thick. I see why they say like, keep it kind of warm. Cause she's thick in there. Like if you see how the way I'm pressing on the bottle and it's not returning to its shape. Yeah, it's a real shea butter, like not fake shea, real shea. Um, and it retailed for $24. I actually want to smell this and see what it looks like. Let's take a look. Let's be nosy together. Let's hopefully she smells good. Cause y'all know, I think we've gotten a couple of orange smelling things from them in the past and they just were not hitting. Oh my God, it's so thick. It's so thick. Oh my God. I'm squeezing the hell out of this thing and it's just not coming out. What is going on? Let's take the top off. Okay, yeah, it is real thick. I'm scared of just gonna go. All right, let's, let's not even, don't poke the bear. <clears throat> this is what it looks like. Oh yeah, it's thick shade. This is really... Th 
It does smell like moringa, though. No. Okay, it's not a very, it's not a, it's a very earthy smell. That's the best way I can describe it. And she's thick, thick butter shea. Okay, like I know my hands are dry. Let me take my ring off. Like this is real shea. I don't mind this. This is nice. Especially if you like have eczema like I do. I like thicker butters like this in the winter time because my eczema just gets out of control. And to like keep that skin from like getting really dry, cracky, uh, almost to it can bleed you guys. Like I have really bad eczema. Um, this is what I would prefer to use. Okay, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. She is thick. She's real Shay. <laughs> okay, guys, let's, let's take a look at the next item. So we have the Cocos Pocus Buffalo Check Baseball Cap that retails for $38. The description says, throw on this stylish buffalo checker hat for all fall vibes. Instead, additional information is a six-panel buffalo check baseball cap. One size fits most. <laughs> Female founded. Okay. Circum the circumference is 58 centimeters. Hopefully it gets on my big head. And like I said, it was $38 um, is the retail price. So let's see. All right. Okay. So, okay. So, okay, we got some more plastic in here. Let's see. Does it fit? Almost. No, it's not bad. Okay. Okay. It's a, it's a little snug. <laughs> I have a big head, but it's a little snug. It's a little, it's a little snug, y'all. Yeah. I think I'm about to give this to my mama because she got a little apple head. <laughs> this is her style. This is definitely right up my mom's style. So yeah, I'm gonna give this to her. We're supposed to be going to the casino this weekend. So I'm gonna give this to her because my big head cannot fit this. Can't fit this, this is a cute cat though, this is cute. So let's look at the next item. The next item that I receive is from Stoho. This is their collapsible cup with four reusable straws and it retails for $31.99. The description says this cup makes it so easy for you to take your favorite drinks on the go. It holds up to 12 ounces, um, includes four reusable straws and removable temperature sleeve. It fits into standard cup holders. Okay, let's take a look at her. Oh, it looks like they have a whole bunch of stuff that they make. Also, yeah, I guess they make reusable stuff. Um, it says, our mission is to end disposable culture, one usable at a time. Okay, so they make a lot of different stuff. So these are our four straws. Oh, they're little short straws. So this must not be a big cup. So four little straws. And they all match the cup. So, oh, shoot. What is that? Okay, is that the... Let's see. Oh, oh, okay. So this has to be the... Uh, what do they call it? The sleeve that they were talking about. Okay, so if this was hot, okay, you could just put it right there. And it won't be so hot for you anymore. Okay, cool. This, the lid comes off. Nice. Got some instructions at the bottom. Okay, so it's like silicone. This is nice. This is different. This is definitely different. Okay, let me put the top back on. How do we... Oh, okay, so it's like a little flap that you just pop up and then it like turns. You can pop it over here. Okay, and then all these little straws. Matchy, matchy. Like, this is cute. All right. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Put your little straw in here. You're good to go. All right, guys. 
let's take a look at the next item. Okay. So I have two items left on my list, but there's three items in the box. We're going to open this not so we don't know anything about this last item, okay? So it says, are you serious? Wait, okay. Y'all see this? This says Heineken. Like, zero alcohol, tastes good, try. Must be 21 or up. Well, if it ain't got no alcohol in it, why should it got to be 21 and up? Hold on. They really sent me a Heineken scan. <laughs> All right. No alcohol content. See? No alcohol. I think I've seen an advertisement for this. Okay, I need to wipe this lid off. All right, where's a, I got a makeup wipe. I need something wet. Actually, no, I got paper towels right here. All right. I always clean my cans off, you guys. Um, yeah, let me press spray some water on this. I'm sorry, I always usually run them in the sink, but um, I'm not near a sink. So we're gonna make do of what we have. So I got some water and some paper towel. I'm gonna rub it down and then we're gonna taste this bad boy. I'm not a beer drinker. Okay. Let's let's pop this baby open. It's a brute ski. It's a brute ski. But it smells alcoholic. Oh my god. Oh. Wait. I gotta readjust myself for this. I gotta prepare myself for this. My hair is already falling down. This is this is not good. Okay, here we go. As nasty as I remember it to be. Moving on, moving on. Yeah, that was horrible. I don't know what made them send me that. Oh, they could have kept that. Oh. Okay. The next item that I have is from Cloud Nola. This is their block clock. It retails for $45. I'm struggling, I'm sorry. Um, the description says this digital clock will add a modern touch to any room in your home. It is a digital alarm clock. Oh, displays temperature and time when it senses movement. Um, includes three AA batteries and a uh, USB cord. What do you need the USB cord for? Okay. So, why does it need a USB cord? I'm confused. Like, if you didn't want to use the batteries. I'm not sure, you guys. So this is what she looks like. Let's put the batteries in and let's play. Okay, so we've got three little batteries here that they provided us with. They gave us the hookup. It says it's supposed to display this, this, this display, display the time and the temperature. All right, so it takes triple A batteries that we're gonna put in here in the back. And I know some of these, I know two of these I like added on, but I don't know which ones I added on to be quite honest with you. So I know I paid a little extra money for the add-ons, but how do I remember which ones I picked? I really don't. Oh, look at that. Okay. It says it's 20 degrees Celsius. It's popping 12 o'clock. 
well, it's not 12 o'clock. It's actually one o'clock, okay? So we'll set. Well, I guess we need the instruction time. Reset. Maybe I have to set this. just happened. I don't know. I guess we need instructions. All right. I'm going to set this clock and then I'll be right back. So this is the little cloud Nola all set. Did I, rec did I say that this was $45? This little thing is $45. You can set this for uh, three alarms uh, if you needed to. So yeah. And also you could plug it in and not use the batteries if, you know, like the power went out, it'll still like kick in. So yeah, there you go. So guys, let's check out the last item. The last item that I have is the Golden Rabbit Small Cobalt Swirl Dutch Oven. It is 2.5 quarts and it retails for $44. And the description says, bake, cook, grill your favorite recipes in this adorable hand dipped Dutch oven made of carbon steel coated with a porcelain enamel. Uh, it is oven, stove top, and dishwasher safe. Okay, this is cute. So I guess there are other sizes to this. They have it in a, which is what I have, the two to three quart. They have it in a four to five quart or a five to six, which is cute. Okay, I have little, bowls I think that actually match this that I've gotten from them before so let's open her up I've always wanted one I wonder I might have to cook something with this today see how she does um if you've ever cooked with a dutch oven let me know let me know what kind of recipes you guys have cooked in them before because I don't even know what I would cook or what type of cooking requires a Dutch oven. Uh, Cause I don't even think I've ever seen even my mom use one of these. Um, okay. Okay, she cute, cute. She little cute. She cute. Okay. So this is what she looks like. You could make like some rice in here. Or I mean, that's pretty simple, right? I mean, you don't need this to make rice, but I'm just saying, like, you're not going to make a lot of stuff in here. Like, this would be, like, maybe your sides or something. Look at that. It says, yeah, cook cuisine, broil griller, bake cure. I don't even know what any of this means. Okay. Do not soak steel rim. Use non-abrasive cleaners for stubborn stains. Wash thoroughly before use. Okay, I'm going to have to get some education on this because this seems a little intense. But this is what she looks like, you guys. Very cute. Not sure if I really like the color, but... It's for cooking. I'm not eating the pot. Um, so yeah, those are all the items I got, guys. So let's talk about it. So guys, we made it to the end of the video. Let's talk about the final thoughts of all these items. Let's talk about the value first. It's supposed to be a guaranteed value of $200 or more. Mine was a whopping $417.97. What you think about that? Let me know down in the comments. But like I always say, the value is always gonna be there, but is your personal value there? Are you gonna use any of these items that you actually got, um, you know, in the next, you know, week, month, year, future, lifetime, whatever. So I did figure out what items I did choose for um, as far as my add-ons. 
So I did choose the coach necklace. So obviously if I chose it, I actually wanted it. So I do appreciate that. I do like this and it was $125 freaking dollars. I did not know that. Um, so yeah, the value is definitely there. I'm actually like that. I think it's very freaking cute. Okay, guys. And it's coach. Who don't like coach? The second item that I got that was part of my add-ons that I added were the canisters. So I paid a few extra dollars for this. It's originally $49.99. I think my price came up to like $80 or so. So I spent like an extra 30 something, almost $40 um, on the extra stuff. So not bad. So if you consider this, I paid like 89, I wanna say about $89. Let's just say I spent $90 but I got $400, over $400 worth of stuff. I think that's a fair payout. Um, so those two items I really like. I really like my little Dutch oven. I'm gonna have to do some research on this, but baby, <laughs> we finna be cooking. We finna be cooking. So I do like this. I do like my um, collapsible little cup right here. This is really cute. Uh, especially if you don't like using like, you know, because of Corona, you might want to use your own cup that you go get your coffee and stuff. You never know. I don't drink coffee. I'm just talking. <laughs> um, another item that I did like was the hair tools that I got. Um, I did need a new, did not need a new eyelash curler. So I'm not really excited about that. Or this lip chap. It's pretty dry my lips feel dry um i'm not a fan of it like it'll it's like something i would grab just to make do um i do like the hand cream that they sent me um what i could live without is this little clock um it really has no place in my house um nothing in my house is like it's like a marble as you can see and it's like kind of crazy that the most marble part is like at the bottom like you really can't tell that that's marble it probably almost looks dirty <laughs> just being honest so yeah that was good what else did i get oh this hat that doesn't fit me it was cute it almost made it to my likes but it doesn't fit me so it's gotta go um They should know better. Um, that was the first time anything like that has ever come in this box. I'm just going to be honest with you. Um, was that all, guys? Was that, was that all I got? I think so. I don't think I forgot anything. Let me know what you guys thought. Overall, I would say it was an okay box. I am actually might say this is the first box. Now, I've been with them since June of 18, so... 19 20 21 it's been three freaking years this is the first box i'm kind of like tapping my chin about i'm definitely questioning the things that they sent um to me um it's not like there's like a way to review so that they know if you liked or didn't like the products it's kind of like this is what we have and this is what we're going to give so you'll get a variety of these items so guys, with that being said, let me know your thoughts. Let me know what you guys think about all these products, if you thought they were valuable or not. Or if you have the box, definitely let me know what you received. Um, yeah, definitely let me know what you guys are thinking, you guys. Other than that, I love you. Have a beautiful day. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, guys. Make sure your notification bell is on. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.